today's discussing topic is about the indication circuits indication circuit what is indication indication means you are just switch on the circuit breaker from the control room and by help of the uh, discrepancy switch or tnc switch from the control room and you have to sanguine that the properly the circuit breaker isolator spring charge of the circuit breaker and also um, the trip circuit 1 and 2 all are properly uh, closed or not or properly completed or not if you uh, want to uh, by help of this indication circuit we can 100% sanguine that this operations has been completed successfully so uh, this is the two circuit here all are the dc we are uh, providing the dc circuit in between dc positive and negative different isolator contacts are there this 29a is the main bus side isolator contact one is nc contact another is the no contact here 29t here 29l 52 a 52 ls this is the push button and this is a indications bulb or indications light this indications or this uh, this is the semaphore it may be the digital semaphore or it may be the analog semaphore rotating type when you are closing the circuit breaker when you are closing the circuit breaker this auxiliary contacts will be change its positions after closing the circuit breaker it will be a nc contact will be the no contact and the dc will be passed through this circuit and this indications of uh, the isolators will be on on positions so uh, we are sanguine uh, 100% sanguine that the main bus side isolator has been properly inserted to its contacts second 29t the same procedures and same function this is the line side isolators this is a 29t uh, it, it it may be the um, transfer bus side isolator 29t so this is the same procedures when we are inserting the transfer bus side isolators if any maintenance job or emergency occurs in the uh, particular bay we are uh, diverting the particular bay through the tbc breaker and tbc isolators so then we are using this when you close these isolators this uh, contact or this indication will be on the on position that means the transfer bus isolator has been properly inserted and when you after uh, utilizations or after properly um, completion of the job if we want to open the um, transfer bus side isolator then uh, this contact will be no and this contact will be nc so that will be go to the off positions and from the control panel we just observes that the line side isolator has been opened successfully and this is 29l the line side isolator the same function as before we have already talked about what is the function l1 the positive side and l2 is the negative side the positive is coming from here and negative is uh, put it in the one point 2 and 3 are the two point one is the off point one is the on point here 52 52 we know all that the 52 is the breaker contact here the breaker contact breaker semaphore when uh, the breaker is on off conditions that is uh, the semaphore at on the off positions and three and when we switch on the breaker this auxiliary contact positions will be changed this auxiliary contact position if changed this nc contact will be the no contact and the dc will pass through this and semaphore will be operated and go to the on positions we will sanguine that the breaker has been closed successfully and this is uh, the 52 ls spring charging uh, contact when the 
circuit breaker uh, has been spring properly charged and one uh, NONC contact are there the after properly spring charged this contact will be NC and the DC will be passed through here from if we push this button then this light will be glow so we sanguine that the spring charge has um, already been ready for the another operations here uh, is the 29 le 29 le means earth isolators the earth isolator contact is here given uh, the same procedures as like as 29 a 29 t and 29 l when we close the lines uh, earth isolators this contact will be make and this earth isolator semaphore will be on the on positions and we will 100% sanguine that the earth is has been uh, properly inserted from the control uh, room and control panel and uh, the work may be started if the maintenance or any type of breakdown um, job will be started then uh, from the indications we are sanguine uh, physically you can uh, physically obviously you have to go to the switchers and you have to sanguine that that is inserted properly any type of flashing will not be there and from the control room for indication purpose for observation purpose that the uh, semaphore has been inserted and semaphore has been on by help of this 29 le and here the uh, trip circuit 1 and trip circuit 2 195 and 295 the two relay are there so 195 is the DC supervision relay for the trip circuit 1 and 295 are the supervision relay for trip circuit 2. Um, the DC from the LO1 is just uh, here and this contact is NC. After the proper operations, after the proper operation you can see the another video from where you can um, <coughs> know about the 195 and 295 of my previous video. Please uh, see my previous video for the details. If we push this uh, button, these two light will be glow uh, simultaneously. So, if uh, 195 is in proper position, that light will be uh, glow. If the 295 is not proper position, the tip circuit has been damaged or tip circuit uh, has a problem. So, this light will not go. When the 195 and 295, two, both light will be glow tip circuit 1 and tip circuit 2 we are sanguine that the tip circuit 1 and tip circuit 2 are healthy this is the auto trip uh, contact if this contact will not make properly if this contact uh, will be will not um, because all the circuit given is the de-energized circuit after properly on of the circuit breaker this contact will be NO, this NC contact will be NO, if that contact will be NC, so the auto trip light will be on. So this 52, the auto trip is mainly um, the reason for uh, the auxiliary contacts. If the auxiliary contact of the circuit breakers are not properly functioning, then this auto trip light will be uh, glow. And if this auto trip light will be glow, you have to uh, just check the auxiliary contact of the circuit breaker if the circuit breaker auxiliary contact problem will be solved this auto trip operation or auto trip of the breaker will not be there so uh, you have to ch check properly uh, during the maintenance time that the auxiliary contact of the circuit breaker has not been sulfated if sulfated different types of spray are there you have to spray as per the proper guideline of the manufacturer's manuals, you have to see these uh, guidelines for the maintenance and how you have to maintenance the uh, auxiliary contact from the manuals of the particular manufacturer's guideline. So this is the auto trip uh, options. So friend, this is the most important circuits, circuitry uh, and very simple circuitry of the control, control CR panel and it's all are connected between uh, the uh, different types of cables different types of uh, control cables so this is the simplified diagram we have discussed today if you're interested please subscribe my channel and press the bell icon for more updated technical knowledge and technical video and please uh, share uh, my video with your friends and colleagues for uh, more updates
सो थैंक यू वेरी मच फ्रेंड्स फॉर वॉचिंग माई वीडियो